McDonald, Chancellor Deadline Day, always a sense of excitement among the fans. What can you tell us about any potential business you might be doing today? Uh, nothing, <laughs> because uh, we did our job with uh, the signing of uh, Charlie Austin. And OK, I mentioned several times that uh, nobody is for, uh, for sale and we keep everybody in. And that's, I think, a good, uh, good news uh, and there will not happen something maybe a young player on loan maybe but not that seriously that uh, other other question in uh, in the in the players is it a good thing in a way to be quiet on deadline day because it, it shows that you've got your business done yeah but it's i don't like uh, really uh, the january uh, business because it's in the middle of the season and and and, and OK, maybe if you are in trouble or if you miss something or if you get uh, bad injuries in your players, then you need something to do. But normally you have to do your, your business and it's not about uh, the last day because if you have to do still on the last day your business, in my opinion, you are too late. How pleased are you just in general with, with the business that's been done in January and how do you feel the squad's looking now for the final few months of the season? No, very good. I think uh, we have a good squad. We have a lot of competition in our squad. That's the reason that sometimes we change the position, we change players and uh, because there is really competition and everybody is training well, everybody deserved uh, his opportunity. And OK, that's, that's, that's football and that's the, the, the highest level, what we, what we like to reach and, and where we like to continue. And, uh, and we had a good run in the last few weeks. It was a little bit strange feeling uh, that we didn't play this weekend. But OK, we know we play Arsenal tomorrow and uh, it's a fantastic game and uh, we're looking forward. I was going to say, indeed, Arsenal, obviously a, a tough game, but, but one that with the, the form you're in, I guess you are very much looking forward to, aren't you? Yes, because uh, normally we have uh, good performances against big teams and uh, because our team is really uh, the team who can uh, give really competition to the big ones. And uh, OK, we had a great result at home against Arsenal not so long time ago. And of course, they, they will show that they are the better team and, and we know it's not so easy to beat Southampton. That game on Boxing Day, obviously, I imagine you've got, got some fantastic memories from that. Does, can that give you some belief ahead of this, uh, this game as well? Yeah, that's not, not only about uh, the Christmas of the Boxing Day game, the, the final result, no. Because we played uh, three times against Arsenal. Uh, four times, sorry, four times uh, before tomorrow. and. Uh, we won, uh, we won three. We won both at home. We won uh, the away game for the League Cup. And we lost in, uh, in the last second uh, by 1-0 last season in, in, the, in the Premier League. And, and that means that, that it's so close. Even they are fighting uh, to win the title and we not. But, but we showed against them uh, to be com very competitive team and a very hard team to beat and uh, that we like to be uh, again tomorrow night. Yeah, I mean, both trips there last season were, were very closely contested games. You obviously, like you said, 1-1 one, one and uh, kind of cruelly lost the other one. You, you've proven that you can go there and, and really match them, haven't you? Yes, because we believe in our qualities. Uh, we have and we play out of a good organisation and uh, that's always difficult for the opponent uh, to beat Southampton. And, and, and that's the reason why we uh, have some good results in the last uh, few weeks and, and we like to continue with that. You beat Manchester United away last time out. How much of a, a different test could Arsenal be? It's a different test because uh, football-wise, attacking-wise, uh, to stop Arsenal is more difficult than, with all the respect, to stop Man United. And, uh, and defensive-wise, we need to be very good because they have some great players. Uh, Alex Sanchez is, is, is back and, and he's one of the players who can win the game for the team by his own and, and, and you have to stop that and, and we will get space and that's always what you do with that space because we cut that space in the first half against Man United. We didn't play really good in the, in the final, final part of attacking and, and that we have to improve for tomorrow. You're in a good position in the league. If you can keep this run going and, and get a positive result at Arsenal, it, it could really set you up nicely for the run ahead, couldn't it? Yeah, that's, that's what we like. Uh, but it's, it's game by game. We know everyone is difficult. 
but that's for Southampton, but for all the teams and uh, and, and the results are always very close to, uh, and okay, we know what we have to do and which performance we need to win uh, against the Arsenal tomorrow. How are you looking in terms of injuries and fitness as well? No, it's very good. Uh, still, the, the same players are out. Uh, J. Rodriguez is not available. He's, he's, he's coming back. He's close to be part of the of the training with the rest of the team. Florian Carlos is still out. Uh, uh, Graziano is, is is better than he was. We have to make the decision today if he's really hundred uh, percent to to play. And uh, that's all. The, and and Stephen Davis is still out which is not a big hamstring, but maybe he needs uh, some days more, but he's not available for tomorrow. Once you start getting these players back as well, you, you must be really satisfied with how the squad's going to be looking. Yes, it's, it's in my opinion, we have a very strong one with a lot of competition. Sometimes difficult because uh, you have to make uh, tough decisions, but uh, that's the reason why you are coach or manager and to make that. And, and I like to have that. Uh, uh, possibilities and to have that uh, players to make that kind of decisions. Just finally, we obviously saw Charlie Austin make such an incredible impact in his first appearance for the club. Possibility that, that he could make his full debut against Arsenal? That's possible. That's possible. Yes, of course, because he showed his quality and if he's really uh, fit, 100% fit after the, the period when he was out, then, then it's a possibility that he will start tomorrow.